When it comes to travel, airplanes are often touted as the quickest and most effective mode of transportation. However, the time it takes to get to the airport, which is often far out of town, go through screening and catch a pre-flight snack can add a few hours to some routes. High-speed trains shine in this scenario. Train stations are usually located in or near the city center, and you don't need to arrive two hours before departure to clear check-in and security lines. Although the United States is not well known for its train systems, Europe and Asia are. Their high-speed rail system is well-developed, and the world's fastest trains run between major cities on a regular basis, such as Shanghai and Beijing or Paris and Strasbourg. In this video, we're going to talk about the Japanese Maglev, the world's fastest bullet train. Just imagine yourself roaring through the Japanese landscape at breakneck speeds. The wheels of your car can barely make contact with the ground. In fact, you're floating. This fantastical experience will soon become a reality, kudos to Japan's famous maglev high-speed trains. Prior to the 1964 Olympic Games, the Shinkansen, the world's first high-speed railway popularly known as the bullet train, held iconic status in its ability to bring athletes from all over Japan to Tokyo. The tale of the bullet train is one of success as well. When it first connected Tokyo to Osaka over half a century ago, trains could only travel at 210 km per hour. Today, they zoom past at 320 km per hour, carrying over a million passengers every day. However, the Shinkansen has now become part of the Japanese mythology and an icon of the nation's technological ingenuity. Japan's next step in developing the express train system has proven a bit more challenging. This stumbling block has a name, Maglev. Although Japan already has a magnetic levitation rail network, the Limino Line in Aichi Prefecture close to Nagoya, it is vastly outmatched by China's commercial maglev service, which travels at 268 miles per hour between Shanghai and Pudong International Airport. The Limino runs at 62. Although Shanghai Transrapid, its official name, has more than 17 years in service, it is still the fastest electric train in the world. Tokyo, which first explored the technology's potential in the late 1960s, is keen to expose a more innovative maglev system to its long-standing rival. Japan is betting big on the Chuo Shinkansen maglev line, which will run at 500 km per hour between Tokyo and Nagoya, cutting travel time in half. The network in Japan, which is expected to open in 2027, is based on superconducting magnets which can teleport trains up to 10 cm with less friction. During the test run in 2015, the maglev train broke previous world speed records by reaching speeds of over 600 km per hour, according to its operator, Central Japan Railway Company. JR Central has been hard at work since then, constructing the line which will largely run through tunnels. On the downside, the coronavirus pandemic has halted construction work in Tokyo and Kanagawa Prefecture after Prime Minister Shinzo Abe announced a state of emergency in April. What are maglev trains? Unlike traditional trains, the maglev uses magnetic levitation instead of wheels. The train is levitated a short distance above the tracks by electromagnets. The thrust that propels the train is also produced by these magnets. Maglev trains have better controls than their traditional counterparts because their acceleration and braking are not affected by track friction. Unsurprisingly, they are extremely costly to build. There are currently three commercial maglev systems in operation, one in Japan, one in China, and one in South Korea. Shanghai Maglev has the maximum run speed of 431 km per hour for an operating train, covering a distance of 30.5 km in 7 minutes and 20 seconds. 80% of the Maglev bullet train's 287 km track would be underground, passing through urban sprawl and mountain passes. When finished, the train will have 16 carriages with a capacity of 1,000 passengers. The public is currently invited to participate in Maglev test drives. To learn more and see maglev test runs, tourists can go to the CS Maglev Parkway in Nagoya or the Yamanashi Prefectural Maglev Exhibition Center near Utsuki. Now, what if I told you that in their 60 years of operation, Japan's high-speed passenger trains have had zero serious accidents, making them one of the most safest modes of transportation on the planet? The maglev system intends to keep its perfect track record. Engineers don't expect the project to be finished for another decade, but with the country's increasingly aging population, the JRC is already looking to export the technology to the United States. JRC is particularly interested in the Northeast Corridor, a 220-mile stretch connecting New York and Washington. Amtrak's Acela line actually takes approximately three hours to complete this journey. With the CS Maglev, it will be reduced to only one. However, putting in a modern high-speed rail system comes at a high cost. 
The first leg, which connects Baltimore to Washington, is expected to cost $10 billion to construct, with the entire Northeast Corridor costing $100 billion. It's a system that Japan has already developed, with one of the world's most comprehensive high-speed rail networks. It now hopes to spread the technology beyond Japan's borders in order to keep the Japanese economy afloat. Do you find this mode of transportation to your liking? Would you like to race at a low altitude? Will the trip to Japan even be on your list? Is it worth the billions of dollars in costs merely to give it a shot? Please let us know in the comments. That's our video on the world's fastest train. I hope you enjoyed it, and if so, then give it a thumbs up and ring the notification bell button for our latest updates. And if you have any ideas of videos you'd like to see, please let us know. Thank you for watching this one. We'll see you next time.